Hey, what's happening? Welcome to UCB Roundup. My name is Matt Fisher. We're here at UCB East as usual. This week we've got a great classic UCB comedy cut, The Dangers of High Fives, the greatest video of all time. And then we're going to be joined by Jesus Christ. And I don't say Jesus H. Christ. We're going to ask him about the middle initial when we get to that. Let's round up. Hey, everybody. Hi, everyone. It's Jesus Christ. I'm Jesus Christ. Thanks so much for having me. Oh, I'm so I listen. Excited. You seem to be in a great headspace. Yeah, I mean, who wouldn't be? I mean, it's Good Friday. Happy Good Friday, everyone. Yeah, man, it's this drops on Good day. Friday. I hope you're having a good one. We should have a son of God every week. I mean, we're all the sons of God, but, you know, I'm like the... I'm like the actual one but i don't i don't want to pull that card now you know i'm Come here on. to just have some fun do some comedy say hi to everyone oh. Oh is it weird dad. to say you're down to earth hey where do you think that phrase comes from really it comes from me i came, came, down, to came earth, down to earth and i'm just also down oh, to earth man. you want to talk about the video of the week yeah let's do it the video of this week is befitting the king of kings it's the danger of high fives uh, a great video starring Lennon Parham, directed by Mitch McGee, written by Craig Rowan, oh. and just amazing. You've already heard about the dangers of drug use in your health class. Now it's time to learn about another harmful epidemic. High five handshakes. You learn while you laugh. Yeah, you learn while you laugh, which is the, what the point of the Bible is. And part of the reason why we bring up this video this evening is because Lennon Parham, the host of the video, amazing. her new sitcom, Playing House, with Jessica St. Clair. Premieres April 29th, Tuesday. It, it is great. I've seen several episodes of it, because I, I I can do that. Yeah. It's amazing. You're actually appearing on UCB's stage. I am. I am so lucky. I'm, a, I'm doing a show. Uh, it's called 1770-something, a musical adaptation of the conservative adaptation of the birth of America. It's about the founding of America, which is I actually had a lot to do with. Right. And it's kind of just like the true story of how I came down and helped the founding fathers build our country, all while fighting the evil King Barack Hussein George the Third. At 1770 something is musical. It's musical it is, comedy. Yes, it's a musical comedy. There are songs in it. I sing a song. We'll make a country I can call with liberty and justice for some. Yes, I can. Uh, it's pretty. I and I'm. I'm. I. I feel good about it. We've. We've actually been doing it for a while, and the last one right. is this coming Wednesday, the 23rd, at 9:30 p.m. at UCB Chelsea. Right. So this drops on Good Friday. You have a big weekend. You're, you're like right. busy it's all a weekend. Huge weekend. Yeah. And it kind of culminates this week with this show. This is like when Bill Murray's on Letterman. It's just like a different vibe. Oh, that's too kind of you. That's too kind. I mean, I guess I'd like to think of myself as the Bill Murray of religious figures. But, I mean, that's really a nice thing to say. Yeah, I, you kind of have it of being, like, mysterious, a little carefree, but does great work. Oh, thank you. Do <laughs> two truths and a lie? Let's do it. Let's do two truths. Are you capable of telling lies? Is this okay? Within uh, the structure of this? Within the structure of it. When we know that one of them might be a lie, okay. it's okay. totally cool. fine. First up, my middle name is Horton. Jesus Horton Christ. Number two, uh, heaven smells like a mixture of cinnamon and pine cones. And number three, uh, Judgment Day is going to be November 19th, 2063. If you have an inkling, please guess it in comments or panic. Uh, as, as you see fit. Last week we had Anthony Apruzzi. Let's check in with him mm. where he will admit what his lie was. Hi, I'm Anthony Apruzzi and my lie from last week's UCB Comedy Roundup is I never wrote Michael Joseph Piazza a letter and he did not return it because that never happened. I don't like anything enough to write it a letter. There you go. Do, do the Mets ever get good? It's not coming anytime soon. The Mets are not going to win the World Series <laughs> anytime soon. But 2028 is going to be a decent year for the Mets. Not saying World Series, but might be saying oh, pennant. Man. Oh, tough. Thank you so much for being here. No, thank you for having me. Next week, you will not get to see the Roundup. We're taking about a month off, and we'll see you when we return. And in the meantime, I hope you're doing well. Have some great times. Any advice? Uh, be yourself, love, love your neighbors, and uh, you know, don't be, don't be afraid to have a, have a party every once in a while. Do that, and we'll see you next time. Have a good one. Thanks so much for watching the video. Watch these videos as well. Subscribe here. Feel here. <laughs>